can't sleep. It's too dangerous. Last year, 18 million died while sleeping. That means sleeping's more dangerous than skydiving. With a bear, as a parachute, over a volcano. Because no one has ever died from that. Trust me. So you're human, you're scared of sleeping now too? You should be. But it's worse for me. I'm a bear. Not that one. Yeah, him. All bears do is sleep. Millions hibernate and never wake up. It's a risk I can't take. But you know that if you don't sleep for an extended period of time, you have the same mental capacity of someone who's intoxicated? I haven't hibernated in five winters. Other bears are like, Dude, you need to hibernate. I'm more fun when I'm awake. Dude, you've lost control. You're an insomniatic. And I was. I'd stay out all winter starting pillow fights with complete strangers. You don't know me. Literally, though, they didn't. The bears had a meeting. They were groggy and angry. Enrique! Guys, please, I... I go by Enric. I've always gone by Enric. You're a disgrace. We're bears. We hibernate. I've seen bears, but you... You're no bear. You have to leave. Give me another chance! No. Okay. Enrique! You know, bullfrogs don't sleep. Maybe you should try being a bullfrog. So I did. Hey, Riggity. You be different all the bullfrogs I haven't met. Don't be so superficial. Do you eat insects? No. You be ain't no bullfrog. The back is killing me. You big. Seriously, it's like someone's punching me in the back over and over. Too big to be a bullfrog. I can't move my leg. You be like a snake. You have too much hair. I think you are a lion. Okay, I wasn't going to say anything, but every time you do the... Your tongue keeps touching my face. That reminds me of something lion would say. I'm no botanist, but if you like fish, everyone knows you're a whale. walked all across the earth trying to figure it out and when I got all the way around I figured I might as well just keep going. So I did. Before long I had been everywhere. Three times. I even went to Iowa. And I got my name in the papers. You know, I went so many places, saw so many people. I knew everybody. Well, almost. I saw someone I had never seen. Why aren't you hibernating? Are you out of your mind? It's a death sentence. I thought all bears hibernate. Perhaps you never consider the fact that I'm not a bear. Here, eat this. What are you doing here, with her? Truth is, I didn't even recognize the place. I told him how in my travels I learned basic survival tactics and attended forums, seminars, and fairs to learn about new agricultural techniques that when applied to certain crops can accommodate a winter harvest, and how I had launched a quarterly publication sharing my insights with other animal breeds. We didn't have any circulation until we started smearing honey on each copy. The subsequent explosion in demand sent stock prices booming. 
I gave all the money to charity. And Rick, you've done great things. That doesn't make you a bear. But he saved my life. I wasn't finished. That doesn't make you a bear. It makes you a great bear. What most bears won't tell you is they really hibernate for the adrenaline rush. They're thrill seekers. They like facing danger. But you know what's scarier than that? Facing yourself. So I guess you can call me Evil Knievel. Wicked and Rickkid. The nefarious bear. Yes. I'll work on the nickname.